Hi, this is Christy with the Sits Girls, and today we're going to be showing you how to make a Pinterest-friendly photo. So go ahead and open up PicMonkey. This is a free program that you can use online. You'll want to click on Edit a Photo, and this will bring up all your photos on your computer. I'm going to go ahead and use a free photo from Morgue File today. Once you have your photo open, you can see it's pretty plain. It probably won't go over well on Pinterest. Um, so go ahead and add in an overlay. And you can scroll through here, and there's so many different ones you can choose from. I'm going to go ahead and use the labels today. And you can select which one you want to use. I'm going to use this one. It comes up pretty small, and it comes up a dark black color. So go ahead and drag that to the area you want to use and resize it. And once you have it the size you want, Go ahead and choose the color. Okay, today I'm going to go with this light aqua blue. Um, you can also go down here to the fade button and fade it out. You can get it pretty light if you want. Today I'm just going to leave it the standard. Once you have it the way you want, the size, the color, the fade, go ahead and click up here. This is going to merge it together. Make sure not to click this until you have it the size you want because this does make it to where you cannot edit it anymore. Then you'll want to go over here to the text. Go ahead and start typing your text. And once you have your text, you'll want to go ahead and click on that. Get this box right here and drag it over to your overlay. You'll want to resize it so it fits inside this overlay nice. And once you have it the size you want, you can leave it this standard font or you can come over here and select a different font. Just scroll through, there is a lot to choose from. There you go, it has the, the font that I would like, and then choose your color. You want to make sure your photos pop, so try to use bright colors. And then once you have your font on there, you are all set. Go ahead and hit save, and your picture is now ready for Pinterest.